Hey guys, what is going on guys? Welcome back to Sunset Park. For everyone newly subscribed onto this channel, I wanna welcome you guys to Sunset Park, yes. So it's week three on Sunset Park. Wow, it's already week three? Sunset Park was like born three weeks ago. This week's theme is social media week and basically we have to talk about how we got involved and how we started on social media. Now I truly wanna apologize to you guys because my, I know my bed is a mess. My shirt all over the place. So back to social media week, how we started on social media. Now my story is a little different than all the other boys. See the way I started wasn't really on social media, it wasn't on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, Facebook. The way I started was actually on YouTube. Now it's so funny because I never seen myself becoming a YouTuber or making YouTube videos. So this all happened about two, three years ago. I actually started on YouTube by making and filming comedy skits, basically little funny videos on YouTube. And I started YouTube for fun. My passion really was to film videos, great funny videos. I love filming funny videos. So weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks go past and I'm only getting 50 to 100 views. Aww. Only my friends were watching and supporting me. Until one day, I was so bored at home, I went on YouTube and there was a trend. There was a, like a prank trend and I was sitting on my bed and I was watching, watching, and then I see this video. I see this video it was a prank and I seen multiple videos. It was prank videos and these pranks were gaining a lot of views and then in my head I was like, Wait, people love pranks? And obviously it clicked in my head because a lot of people like to laugh, so pranks are really funny. So I decided to film a prank. I go outside, my first ever prank was sitting on people. Basically, I went to people and I started sitting on them, and it was so fun and hilarious. Some people took it the wrong way, but most people laughed because I revealed to them they were on a camera, and they were laughing hysterically, and that really made my day, because making other people's day makes my day. Anyway guys, so basically I filmed this prank video and I uploaded it on my YouTube channel. The video is not even getting a lot of views. My friends were the only ones supporting me. The same thing as the comedy skits, I was getting the same amount of views. And I was about to just quit YouTube because I was so tired. I was only getting 50 to 100 views. Now this is where it gets really, really interesting. Sit tight guys, listen to this. <laughs> so a week later, I'm eating outside with my friend. My friend shows me my video on World Star Hip Hop. That's basically at the time. It was the most popular website on the internet for young teenagers. A lot of teenagers know what World Star Hip Hop is and a lot of them go and watch funny videos. There's a lot of crazy dumb videos on there. But basically my video went on that website and it went viral. And what I mean viral at the time, I only had like 2,000 subscribers. It gained over 500,000 views. That's half a million views in less than 48 hours, which is less than two days. Can you believe that? I got so excited. I showed my mom, I showed my dad, I showed my little brother, my sister, all my friends, and they were so excited for me. Ever since that video went viral on World Star Hip Hop, I started filming more crazy videos because that's what people wanted to see and that's what they liked. So something more interesting happened I want to share with you guys. At the time, me and my brother were filming videos and we met Kobe through the YouTube community, Kobe Pearson actually on Sunset Park. Now he's like a brother to me. So he's seen one of our videos online and he messaged me on my personal Facebook and basically he said, let's meet up. I love your videos, let's do a collab. And, I, and at the time we thought this guy, Kobe, was gonna like kidnap us or something. So time passes by and me and Ethan actually meet with Kobe. We talk with him. We get to know each other and we start collaborating on YouTube videos. And ever since then, we were just making videos and videos and videos and videos together. So let's recap. I told you guys I started from YouTube. From YouTube, we filmed a viral video. From the viral video, we met Kobe. And from there, that's when I actually got on social media, which was Snapchat, Facebook, Instagram, because a lot of our viewers on YouTube and fans asked us to make these social media so we can communicate with them every day. And from them, that's where I signed up for social media. And right now, I love it so much. Now, fast forward two years later, social media is like my life. I'm literally on social media every single day, every single second to check my notifications, to communicate with my fans I love talking to you guys so much you guys give me a lot of tips and advice on what to do and I always take your advice into consideration always like literally the best way to actually contact me is through Instagram and Twitter I'm always responding and talking to you guys my personal YouTube channel will be on the top of the description below I also wanted to mention it it's so funny because whenever we started making videos and we're gaining a lot of followers on social media all my friends in the beginning who thought I was stupid making these funny videos they told me I was wasting my time they called me a retard they called me dumb they told me my YouTube videos wouldn't even go anywhere and then that kind of got me upset but whenever my videos started gaining a lot of views 
it was so funny because all the people who doubted my YouTube videos and called me stupid started coming back and saying, yo, you was on Worldstar. Yo, your videos are all over Facebook. Yo, your videos have a lot of likes on Instagram. And in my head, I'm like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But then in front of them, I was like, yeah, bro. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Listen, I never hate on anyone. I love everyone. I respect everyone and what they do. And I wish everyone the best in life. I don't believe in hate. I believe in love. I'm a loving person. I love everyone. If you want to talk to me, add me on all my social media. My Instagram is right here. My Snapchat's right here. My Twitter's right here. I'm also on Musical.ly if you guys like lip singing. I'm on every single thing. I also have a personal YouTube channel. I'm also always on Snapchat, guys. I'm sorry guys, excuse me. Oh wow, look who came and visited me. You guys won't believe who came and visited. We have a special guest, Sky! Sky, say hi Sky. Aww. So cute, so cute. Woo, woo, woo. Anyway guys, I'm gonna end the video. I'm gonna go play with Sky right now. See you guys on Saturdays with the boys. I can't wait to see you. We filmed a funny video for you. I can't wait till you guys see it, right Sky? Sky even knows what we filmed, right Sky? After you guys see me on Saturday with the boys, I'll see you again on Monday for Mo Mondays. Bye, guys.